to civilian. A flag saluting motherfucker. The tailor. You, you stayed slim, you could buy right off the rack. They lost his son, you know. What do you mean, lost? Dead. Mort. Uh, just a... Just a fucking kid, a, a baby. When the tailor says, just a kid, a baby, I can't help but think of someone else here. 47. He was a fucking kid. Fucking animals. AJ's school psychologist. Um, hi. In many respects, Anthony is a normal, healthy eighth grader. Sister Patricia, his art teacher, thinks he shows strong skills and spatial orientation. I mean, everybody agreed that I had extraordinary visualization skills. Anthony sometimes has trouble following the rules, weighing consequences. At times, doesn't think before he acts. Hmm, remind you of anyone? The bakery employee? Whoa, number 34, right here. He was in line, man. He just went out to go get gas in his car. Hey, poppin' fresh, I'm in no fucking mood. Fuck you. Okay, take a walk. That's better. Now fill it with cannoli, Schwiedel, and Napoleons. Christopher Moldesanti passing down the spider tradition. Next time you see my face, show some respect. I will. Fanny. She was my best friend. If anybody died or was in the hospital, I could be sure I'd get a call from Lee letting me know. That's what friends are for. Thank you, Fanny. Thank you. You know, the streets. It's another pain in the ass. Fucking D girl. I like those. Manila Bonner. Look, but you can't dodge. Chris, it was wrong with us and and Greg and all that. I really like you. Fucking D girl. Excuse me? Excuse me, I'm a vice president, you fucking asshole. The pizza parlor owner. If you're gonna smoke, take it outside. Fuck's the matter, you don't speak English? Who the fuck are you? The owner's a dear friend of ours. Jackie, what are you doing? Fucking craziness. You all right, Roy? 20 years I'm collecting these things. What the fuck? It's only glass. Saskia. Have you talked to Jason LaPena lately? Actually, I try not to. When I came out, he acted all weird. Check out the law center. There's some really cool people there. Lois. Huh? Yeah. She's fine. We had a great morning. Jesus, that's a beautiful horse. It's gonna be a bottle of LePage you don't win this race. Bubbly, you want a sure thing? Buy bonds. Lois is the best trainer here. They found pieces of a blown-out light bulb in a stall. And the hay was a natural accelerant. They'll investigate, but it's a formality considering the value of the stock. Cookie. I don't understand. When I was a kid, you two were old ladies. Now I'm old, 
And you two are still old. So make sure that she knows she can't sit with me and Min and our other girls. We're a set group. We eat together, we play Scrabble for money, and there's really no room at either table. Oh, Massachusetts! <laughs> for the love of God, Nucci, how could you hit on 18? Give me another one. That should have been my card. I could have had 21. I was hoping for a three. I'm not sure you understand the fine points. Maybe you ought to play roulette. Min. Who's there? What are you doing? Min, your door was open. I bought you something for my mom. What are you doing? Calling your mother. You got any coffee? My kitchen's all wiped off for the night. You're here to rob me. No, no. What are you, crazy? Help! Dominic. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Dominic, and I'm an alcoholic and an addict. Some of you obviously don't know. I've also been in recovery now, going on four years. During my first intervention, Stephen Petrano waited 10 hours for me to sober up. Your first intervention? 1997, I suffered a relapse. Great. So he's taking advice from a two-time loser. There are no losers in recovery. Felicia told him. So, you guys gonna get married or what? Living together is the same thing. Uh-uh. You could just pack up and leave whenever the shit hits the fan. Wait a minute, is that why you got out the suitcase? These are difficult choices. What, you'd rather not have choices? Thank God for choices. The Hotel Bellboy, a.k.a. a young Lin-Manuel Miranda. Excuse me. This place, is it new? I think maybe. I don't know. There was a motel on this spot, though, right? The Haven Air? I don't know. AJ's school friend, a.k.a. a young Lady Gaga. I think I swallowed some water. You girls see me out there? Yeah, it looked like you were cheating. <laughs> Fucking start. Hey guys, we got Mr. Goodwin's office open. Check it out. <laughs> the store employee. You never see a blue comet in that condition. I mean, look at the coaches. Every window still lights up. That train still ran New York to AC, Atlantic City would be a much different place today. Better class of people. I suppose. Who the fuck really knows? Still, it's nice to think that. There's other people interested. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video.